Well, Rick Hendricks, one of legendary owners, champions, uh, points championships, team championships, owners championships. He's got four hot cars. They all did well in Phoenix, the Phoenix 500 last week. Well, there's post-race inspections with the cars, and they found what they call illegal levers, which are air intake levers that are in the hood of the car that helps airflow into the car, sucks the car to the ground. They found four illegal air intake lids on these cars. I don't know how they got there. I don't know how Hendricks crew chiefs thought they could pass inspection with these things. They just suspended the crew chiefs of all four teams for a month. They stripped each guy of a hundred points. They find each crew chief, a hundred thousand dollars. Wow. They find Hendrick, the owner, 400 points and another hundred thousand dollars. And they find the drivers a hundred thousand dollars. It's the biggest mass sanctioning of anybody in NASCAR history. How could you think you could cheat and not get caught in post-race inspection? It's, I mean, it's staggering. And Hendricks has such a phenomenal reputation as an investor and as an owner. There's, he's built all these cars for all these winners of the championship. It's a stunning story. Yeah, I mean, this is incredible because, um, you know, the whole, the, that was the thing. Remember, like we're talking about Days of Thunder, you know, and, and when the, the, the race car driver played by Tom Cruise, he comes over to, to NASCAR. And the, 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 the crew chiefs was telling them, yeah, all these cars are supposed to be the same. You know, they're not like the open wheel Indy cars. So it's interesting that these guys are trying to find loopholes. You know, it's like, you know, your, your old colleague, Jim Rome, he says, if you ain't cheating, you ain't trying. <laughs> but how it, 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 you would imagine that uh, the, the, those inspections would be rigorous. And how could you be such a doofus to think you can get away with something I mean, like that? I'm, I've been a NASCAR, IndyCar, Formula One fan my whole life. I grew up in NASCAR. I've never seen anything like this to this magnitude. Yeah. That's a big, big issue. Okay.